phase 7 after my rhinoplasty operation. Um, <clears throat> the bruising continues to decrease and the swelling too is uh, completely removed from the surrounding areas like on my forehead and my cheeks don't feel tender or swollen at all anymore. Um, the nose of course however is still swollen um, but it is lessening, definitely lessening quite a bit. On top of that the pain is non-existent and I'm starting to get um, all of the kind of debris through so not a lot more is coming out which is really pleasant although I still haven't regained back my full breath um, through my nostrils I think this is probably due to the swelling but there's still you know, almost uh, it sounds congested even though I don't feel congested necessarily um, although it's only today where I've really realized that I'm not congested and it is just the uh, um, swelling probably of the, of the nostrils but it's uh, not particularly discomforting at all, just hopefully it will uh, continue to improve as the healing process continues. Um, I did accidentally bump my nose today. Um, by bump I mean very, very light tap, but uh, it still was very painful. Um, just on the tip I kind of knocked it as I was doing my daily things, just with my hands I went past, but that was um, still extremely painful, so uh, I think that's normal to assume that it's still quite tender at this point even if without it being touched it doesn't cause me any discomfort whatsoever at the moment. Um, I'm finished on all of my uh, prescribed medications so now I just continue to take the vitamin C um, and I think it's a good habit that I'll just continue now from from now on uh, although perhaps not two a day but one but um, yeah it's definitely been uh, a lot of work to continue to clean, remember to take the medications all the time, especially if someone is forgetful as myself. But it's not too inconvenient to a daily routine, of course. And uh, I am still doing the cleaning process with hydrogen peroxide and the ointment I have uh, to make sure everything is kept clean. But I'm pretty sure that all of the wounds are pretty well healed now anyway. Um, I'll be having the stitches removed tomorrow, which will be fantastic because they are a little bit um, in the way. Uh, especially the ones on the lower bridge of the nose. I can definitely feel that they're there sometimes and they tickle me slightly, which is uh, obviously not great if I'm trying not to sneeze, to have them sort of you know, irritate the area. I'm um, also very much looking forward to having this, this removed. It started to feel very kind of heavy and a little... I can feel the adhesion uh, beneath the uh, cast now. I think it's I'm getting more movement back in my face. I'm you know, able to smile and laugh in. I'm you know, movement of my nose now occurs with my facial expressions, whereas before I was uh, kind of keeping very stern, very still, and <clears throat> trying not to move my nose. And I think that's caused it to loosen it a little bit, which means now I can kind of feel that it's a little sticky under there, so can't wait to get it, get it taken off. I did have some dry skin just on the top, but I think this is probably also due to the thing that I'm you know, being very careful not to get it wet, so I'm keeping the whole area very dry. And, Therefore, I'm using um, kind of uh, an anti-blackhead removing lotion to kind of clean the skin areas around my face without getting my whole face wet. Uh, I think that might have caused it to get a little dry there. Other than that, um, very excited to see my nose tomorrow. And it seems like the healing process wasn't really such a big deal, deal at all. Um, once the badge is off, I'll more carefully document the reductions in the size of my nose from the reduced swelling, um, because right now the only areas I can actually see is this uh, lower portion, which I assume is one of the more swollen areas, and uh, it does make gauging it on a day-to-day -day basis a little bit difficult. Thank you for tuning in.